What's up skate rats, it's Skate Dad, and today I'll be reviewing a product. I'm just gonna say right off the bat, I love these knee pads. These are the 187 Killer Knee Pads, the Pro Edition, and they are really, really excellent. I've tried knee pads from ProTech, Triple Eight, and Scabs, and these are night and day, better than the rest. Part of that, to be fair to the other knee pads, is they cost a lot more. Depending on prices, it's fluctuating. They can cost between $75 and $90. So they are more expensive, but they are so much better than any other knee pad I've used before. What I love most about these knee pads is they are incredibly padded. When you squeeze them, it feels almost like a high-end memory foam that's in the inside. So when you slam and fall onto your knees, it really, absorbs everything. I was really impressed when I fell for the first time how little I felt when my knees hit the ground. Like I've skated a lot of other kinds of knee pads and they protect your knee and it is good for the most part, but you still feel something. And the knee pad might slide around a little bit or get a little damage. Or these, you hit the ground and you really feel nothing on your knees. And because they stick out much further, I notice your knee hits the ground sooner than with other knee pads. So I think maybe it's like less distance to fall so it's not as hard but i found you hit the ground and they slid much easier i think that's part of because it sticks out so much it's really easy to slide on and maybe the plastic they're using but these protect your knees so well so on protection i give them a 10 out of 10. one of the reasons that attracted me to these incredibly expensive knee pads is that the caps are replaceable which is really crucial because if you're going to invest a almost a hundred dollars in a set of knee pads they're going to need to last a long time so that's how i justified buying them that well you know i could destroy three pairs of crappy knee pads or i can buy one really nice pair and then just replace the cap so that to me is a really excellent feature and the other thing because you can remove the cap it makes it much easier to wash knee pads and clean them so they don't get stanky the only thing about these knee pads that takes some getting used to is the size of them because they have so much padding and they're so thick and it really sticks out it takes a bit to get used to because they're so big and bulky i've skated a lot of knee pads so it didn't take me very long to get used to but if you're going from never having skated knee pads to these they're gonna feel gigantic and like you're wearing a set of football pads they are super, super protective, and it's just gonna take you a minute to get used to having that extra bulk on your legs. The Velcro on these is really excellent. One of the biggest issues I have run into with knee pads is that the Velcro isn't grippy enough and comes undone or it starts losing his grip. I'm looking at you, Triple Eight, but these ones, the grips really well and it's on there. On my Triple Eights, I was constantly having to adjust them because they're getting looser or the Velcro's coming off. I was always having some issue with the Velcro on them, but these, they just lock right on and the Velcro stays stuck. Like if I put it on there, it's just not coming off. It's really, really on there. So the Velcro on these is excellent. And another tip just to keep your pads like Velcro working well, don't put them in the washing machine and really try to keep that area clean if you can and keep the Velcro closed when you put them away so dirt and grit doesn't get into Velcro and then you're going to lose the grip on your Velcro on your knee pad. Okay, the other thing about them, which is excellent, there's a thing I hate about a lot of knee pads is that you have to take off your shoe to put them on. The really nice thing with these is they're just strap. Like it just has a back strap, so all you have to do is put it onto your knee and boom, you're done. I really hate having to take my shoe off at the skate park to go through that little strap. So it's so nice that I can just throw these on in almost no time and I don't have to take my shoe and get my sock all gross in the parking lot. That's disgusting and boom, they're on and they are so comfortable and feel really great. This feels like an ad for them, but I'm not sponsored by them anyway. I really, really like these knee pads so much. Okay, so how would I rate these knee pads? I'd give them for protection 10 out of 10. These are by far the most protective knee pad I've ever skated. For comfort, I'll go with 9 out of 10. I feel them very comfortable, but because they're so big and bulky, I could see someone who's maybe even a smaller person, these would feel gigantic on and it could really distract from their skating, especially like if they're skating street and not transition. I could see how that could be annoying. 
and fourth budget. So they are very expensive. And I know it's a luxury that I can get to buy these almost $100 knee pads, but I view it as like an investment because one, if I wreck my knee to fix it in the United States is gonna cost thousands of dollars, where $100 spent to protect my knees is very cheap. And I viewed it this way, that's like, I've bought a lot of $30 pairs of knee pads and I destroy them really quickly and they start falling apart. So I view it as if I can hopefully have these expensive knee pads for you know a year or two, it'll really be worth it versus me going through three pairs of crappy knee pads. So that's how I justify the price. So on budget, I'll give it seven out of 10. I could understand why you would wanna go lower on the budget score, but I view because you can replace the kneecap on them, I view it over the long run, it might end up being around the same price if you skate a lot to just buy the expensive knee pads versus you're just destroying crappy knee pads constantly. So I think the 187 Killer Knee Pads Pro are excellent and I recommend that you get them if you're looking for a high-end knee pad and also if you're looking to spend money buy some skate dads shirts on amazon just type in skate dads with a z and you'll see all the shirts i make and while you're waiting for these beautiful shirts or knee pads to arrive watch this montage of me skating in these knee pads